Welcome back. Some women who have gotten facial fillers or breast implants are reporting an unexpected reaction to the COVID vaccine. It's alarming at first, but a plastic surgeon tells us it's harmless. We've heard of the mild flu-like symptoms that could come with the COVID-19 vaccine, even those underarm swollen lip nodes that have startled some women. But now plastic surgeons like Joshua Lampert say some women are reporting a new reaction. Patients getting swollen and even red breasts that have had breast implants, some even placed many years prior um, after vaccination. At first, it can be a bit scary because it mimics an infection. This is what one patient experienced after receiving the Pfizer vaccine, redness accompanied by pain and swelling. This photo from a publication in The Breast, a medical journal for clinicians, shows the patient five days after some conservative therapy like an anti-inflammatory. The 52-year-old woman had undergone a cosmetic breast augmentation procedure 17 months prior. German researchers reported four noteworthy cases. Here in Miami, Dr. Lambert says a 35-year-old client noticed changes after she contracted the COVID infection itself. About 10 days after her breast implant surgery, she was doing great. Uh, she developed a cough and then she developed um, uh, some COVID symptoms, was COVID tested positive, And then within 24 hours developed a severe bright red breast symptoms that also involved swelling and pain, almost resembling like a breast infection on both sides. Dr. Lampert says the redness and swelling fluctuated depending on her fever. Now, initially, when I saw this for the first time, it was alarming. Um, but then after searching the literature and finding reports of patients after vaccines presenting like this, it makes a little more sense that um, someone would mount some type of immune response to something that's like a foreign body, like a breast implant. Or dermal filler. People who have had facial cosmetic work also reported similar reactions. Doctors say any foreign material may cause a reaction when our immune system is triggered, but that it's not to be concerned about. So what does it mean instead? You know, it is something to, to think about and also, you know, trying to look at the patient individually and see when's the right time, when, when's the last time they had a vaccine, when have they had a booster, when are we planning the surgery. Bottom line, Dr. Lambert says if this happens to you, talk to your doctor, but just relax and monitor it. It should subside in a matter of days. And while it might be a scary sight, Dr. Lambert says it's important to get the vaccine because the effects of COVID can be much scarier. And Dr. Lambert says the woman who saw symptoms after getting exposed to COVID was treated with acetaminophen and doing well with no other surgeries needed. So the big takeaway here, talk to your doctor so you can plan your shots, your boosters around any procedures. And if it does happen, don't panic, but talk to your doctor.